Time for more from backstage at Rockfest, Cadott, Wisconsin. I'm Lou Brutus. My dear close personal friend, Eric Boatwright from Shallow Side is my guest. It's nice to see you. It's nice to see you too, bud. We were uh, discussing uh, a little bit earlier today between us that you have had really good luck playing sets here, uh, but then your luck ran out after the music was over today. But my luck ran out. Uh, <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Got one in. Uh, yeah, um, as, soon as, as soon as we jumped off stage... Uh, we had realized that our generator had uh, had died out, so we um, left a 110 degree stage to go to a 150 degree bus. Living the dream. Yeah. So everyone watching want to be a rock star. That's what it's about. Hot. Everyone thinks it's so glamorous <laughs> out here. It's all happening. <laughs> it's all happening. So uh, <laughs> what do you do to fix that when you're in the middle of? the cornfields of Kadot, Wisconsin. Uh, you, you pray to the whiskey gods. I, <laughs> That's all you can do uh, at that point. So is it fixed? I don't think they hear my prayers. Oh. I think there's a lot of people praying for rain right now. You so. got to pray, boy. <laughs> That's pray. what we need. We need Pastor Lou in here to help <laughs> us out. <laughs> you got to put your hands on the generator. You got to put your you hands down. You got to put the hands down. I, I don't I don't know how it was going to turn out, but I I know that it's uh that it's hot and there's um, four other dudes counting on me and I left them so and they're they're, they're all prayed. making their own gravy right now too. <laughs> You're going to get there. Doing. It's going to be like sitting in a moat. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, let's talk about something maybe a little bit more pleasant. Um, before we talk about the actual new record and the content therein, maybe you could talk about. Uh, a little bit uh, about showcasing and and getting it together for booking agents, artists, and all this uh, happy nonsense that goes on in this business. Uh, well, you know when we when we first started playing music, we had no clue that there was an opportunity to um, play a show and have other people judge you as if you were diving off of a diving board and they all like flip up their five cards and because it's not hard enough right you know? it's, yeah. it's it's not hard enough that there's you know nancy that uh she's been listening to music since she was four years old and now she's 470 and if her beer isn't the exact um degree then she's already pissed off so you got to cater to that human regardless and then you got someone in the back that's I don't know if this guy's gonna cut it or not. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah just, uh-huh. <laughs> uh huh. What? And he's mm-hmm. he's swiping through Tinder. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. So uh, <laughs> it it um it's it's an interesting concept. But we uh and, and and I'll say this once and I'll say it a thousand times. We are blessed to be given an opportunity for anyone yeah. to to witness and be a part of uh rock the rock that we are given and and the talent that we were given to to create so regardless of who is in the crowd we it's a it's a blessing to be able to do that and then to be able to be judged uh is also a very strange blessing but i will take it uh regardless but to to step to step up organize and uh be a part of uh arlene's grocery in uh, new york city is where we did a showcase which is uh, the, the place is legendary it's a, it's a famous itself. club and it is uh just a little background history in case you're unfamiliar um, hundreds, thousands of bands have showcased there for record companies and TV people, and it's where you go in New York when you want the people in the business to see you. And th- and these are these are all set up, and everybody's invited, and you're kind of expecting them to come out and see this. Yep, and 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 they did, and they showed up in full, and we had you know a, a plethora of uh, of fans that were you know have been you know long fans of the of the band, and we avoid uh, New York City like the plague. Not for any other reason than traffic. It terrifies us. We grew up with, you know, farm towns everywhere. If a tractor was on the road, that was the only traffic <laughs> you were in. And they literally will sit in traffic for hours to make it 10 miles, yeah. which is mind-blowing. So we, uh, to, to be there and to be a part of it, um, it, it was great. It went great. We were offered um, a handful of uh, booklets if, if you will, of contracts, and, th- and they were throwing novels uh, that, that they have, you know, written in for, for decades. And um, a few people read through them. I glanced over a couple of words, right. uh, went through the, the fine print, and um, we decided to move forward uh, wi- with ourselves and for ourselves. Today's age doesn't 
really call for a necessary label to, right. to stand on top of you and tell you how things and should be and shouldn't be. And that's not to take away from uh, what they have done because the, the things that those labels have done is remarkable. And, the, and they've, they've made lives for me and you right. better just because of the, you know. the content they've put out and the, and the, the resources that they have uh, with them. So uh, but that harkens back <coughs> to another time. Right. And, and in today's world, the, you're everything that uh, that a, a label or any kind of publishing outfit would would need to to make things happen. You have that at your fingertips now every time you turn your phone on. So uh, looking at that, realizing that and understanding wha what the, the future holds for any artist upcoming and already developed, uh, everything literally is in the palm of your hands and you control the 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 entire market so it's where we moved from so then let's talk about the new music uh in and of itself uh tell us about it the content uh saints and sinners a uh our first debut album so we released three eps before mm -hmm. all on our own back we have been rocking now with uh thermal entertainment which is our management company right. uh, family of ours and uh <coughs> we we sat down with elvis basket in Orlando, Florida, which if you're familiar with his work, he's done um, Incubus, Three Days Grace, yeah. Chevelle. I, I the legendary Elvis Basquiat. Yes. Actually. The, goes, I think. Yes, yeah. the, the, the list goes on. And his talent m meets that and surpasses it because of every, every human that's ever heard his work has heard it through the, the mouth and guitar on stage of another human mm. like this guy sits back and he is the Wizard of Oz and uh, we were lucky enough that he had an open slot decided to take us on I sent him a couple of demos that, that we had prepped up and uh, we had a phone call and uh, I talked to him realized that he had a uh, <coughs> ridiculous southern accent just like myself and I was <laughs> like all right we're gonna hit this thing off he's from Virginia and he's you know traveled the globe and uh, he wanted to know what the album was going to be about and i simply stated this is my shot to tell my personal story this is this is where i came from it's 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 all black and it's all white it's there's nothing straight down the middle it's the good the bad w with the ugly and the beautiful that i've been able to be a part of we've been a band now in shallow side for uh eight years and we started literally from the bottom from a place that anyone else would expect to start from except for no one in our families has ever played music or been a part of music and they uh the the grounds where we started from was was literally finding the rocks and foundation of the earth above us mm. so we could find something to stand on before we started seeing where the clouds were so it, it's a uh, always been a uh, a struggle of good and evil you mm. know past and present and with the future involved in it and uh, th and th that's where the album originated from we sat down in Orlando Florida with Elvis and uh, and pitched this entire thing and the songs flowed and now we have a, a 10 song full album and uh, what will be considered our, our debut album so when do people get it where do people get it July 26th it's available everywhere the best place to find it uh, is shallowside.net you can find that uh, directly from us the source signed sealed delivers I'm yours and what about your plans through the rest of the year because I want to see you again uh, well right now we're, um, we're we're pulling back on what is uh, our typical motto for running the roads rampant yeah, we, you're normally balls out we, we usually do no less than 200 shows a year and uh, we're, we're starting to rethink that just simply because I'm having to work on generators. <laughs> I'm not very good at working on generators. No, it's, a, it, it's, it's coming to a point for us that um, we, we want to select our shows a lot, a lot better. And we have the, the freedom to mm -hmm. now. We've, we've paid the due that, that is for every dive bar from Florida to Washington, from Southern California to Maine, and everywhere in between. We've played, ev you, th there's not a dive bar that we haven't touched. Um, and now it's to the point where we would like to stand back, select our shots, because we've, we've 
personally earned that for, uh, within ourselves. Right. So that's where we're at with the with the rest of the year. There's going to be select shows um, decided upon, you know, in in the future, and then we're gonna we're gonna release select dates and and go out and hit those uh, as the release comes out. And then there's going to be a lot more music videos, a lot more stories that are going to come from this. Well, I look forward to it. It's always great to see you. I'm, I'm glad see. you had a great day up until the generator today. <laughs> I'm still having a great day. Shallowside.net, the place to look for more. I'm Lou Brutus. We are backstage at Rockfest, Cadott, Wisconsin. Please, whiskey gods, heal thy generator. Mm.